X-Men, X-Men. Selene says, your carelessness, Friedrich, nearly caused my death, but I offer you this opportunity to atone for your transgression. And he just bends over and goes like, ah, and like becomes a dog man. And she goes, find her blood scent. Friedrich says, as my, as goddess. my goddess commands. And everyone's like, what the fuck just happened? Why is he barking? Sean's like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> Tessa, analyze. And she goes, most probably a specific voluntary transmutation talent akin to lycanthropy activated through some psychic interface with Selene's own power. That's how we did it <laughs> nope. in ancient Anatolia, bitch. <laughs> Anyway, he does manage to track down Rachel, but <laughs> Rogue is trying to help. So Friedrich tears Rogue's costume. Oh no, his bare skin is touching mine. Oh, Immediately, Rogue absorbs Von Rome's power, his memories, the totality of his psyche. And since he was Celine's slave, she becomes the same. Your blood, your heart, you wretched girl, <laughs> are mine. And soon, so soon, your soul will belong to my goddess. What are the rules here? This is something that happens to Rogue sometimes, like minds that are more powerful than hers. And in this case, I guess it's Celine's oh, mind influencing There are a lot of minds more powerful. Unfortunately for Rogue, there are a lot of minds more powerful than Rogue's. <laughs> then Rogue goes, what? And suddenly she is wrapped in rock and earth. This prison of rock should hold you. Also, kid, he's like, what the fuck? Like, what <laughs> is going on? Why is any of this happening? I hate it. It was like, why does this vampire have the power to turn my friend into a feral child? Kitty sort of is like turning to Chris Claremont. Like, can you explain her powers? Because we're very confused.